Happy holidays from Radio Medium to you. We plan to take a short break before returning in the new year. In the meantime, here is the best from 2020. Laura Lee tuning in to Spirit for my special guest, Joyce. Hi, Joyce. Hi. Joyce, where are we connecting with you from? In Lockwood, California. Hope you guys are staying safe out there. Yeah, we have been so far. Good. So, Joyce, I have actually two spirits I'm seeing that are approaching you off onto your right side. And I would say one's paternal figure. The other one, though, I beg to differ only because he's coming up alongside of you. And when I see them alongside of a person, they could be a brother, uncle, or all those things. My brother. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He places his arms around you and squeezes you tight and lays his head on your shoulder. Did he wear cowboy hats on occasion, honey? That was my stepdad. I see the cowboy hat being taken off and placed on the heart. That was my stepdad. Totally honored. Uh, Wants to make indication of that. But your brother is saying it's okay. And I think your brother is the one who kind of said sick leave of absence. If you know what that means. Yeah. Okay, so he didn't tell anyone how bad it was. No, Do you no, know? he didn't. He was alone and kind of distanced from the family. Well, gosh, this was because of COVID anyway, right? Or was it more than that? That's it was my, more than that. Yeah. He didn't have COVID. Yeah, the brain spender. Yeah, yeah. He says, but he knew on some level and didn't tell. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he knew something was going on. Now, did you guys have some sort of funeral service, but you were all in cars? Well, we had a service, but we went all in. Everybody went down. We had to drive down to where it was in our cars. We went to a different town. You went to a different we town? Okay, because when I see drive-by, and I also feel like it was a convoy, you know? But I feel like this wasn't a group gathering as much as it was just to come and pay respects. Do you understand? Oh, that's the hospital. Oh. That's when we were at the hospital. All his family, his brothers, his sisters from out of state, his kids, his grandkids, my mom, all of us went to the hospital the night and I was from us to him. He says, I love you. You wouldn't be bashful of saying that. He says, there's other kids you need to tell that he loves them as well. Do you understand? Yeah, I know who that is. talking about his kids. Yes, and there's a son he especially. Said, yep. And he says, he doesn't understand. He doesn't know how much I love him. <laughs> and he has his son's very lost right now. Yeah, he says he's with him. Is there a name connection between him and his son, or is this somebody else, honey? There's the older son. Okay. The older son has the same name. And will you tell him as well, because he knows it a little bit better than this one, but he's... Yeah. Oh, okay. I see people going through stuff of his. I don't know. Woman holding up shirts, t-shirts, and putting them in a pile. Not me. It's okay. his wife. And I feel like they're putting them in a pile to disperse them, but somebody's wearing his no. t-shirts. Oh, I, I know his, his son took his shirt that he used to wear, his Hawaiian <laughs> shirt, so he could wear it to represent his dad. That's what my brother wore when he went out and thought it was fancy. He wore his Hawaiian <laughs> shirt. <laughs> I feel like this was really recent. I get yeah. an anniversary, birthday, July. Yeah, it was, he passed away in July. His birthday this month. Oh, his birthday's this month. That was a confirmation to the t-shirt pile or the pile of shirts, okay? And somebody wearing them. Yeah. Because he is close to everybody right now and <laughs> wants to pass on that message. But he is also there with this other gentleman that you say is a father, a stepfather. But he's with him. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Louis. Yes. Love you very much. And tell me, love me. <laughs> oh, he hears you. That's why this call happened, honey. <laughs> I miss you so much. I know. Thank you for sharing your time with me, Joyce. You're welcome. If you'd like to be my special guest caller, sign up at radiomediumlarley.com. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our show on any podcast form. It is free.